For the times when you don't have enough light in your space or maybe no light at all, looking at your laptop or PC screen can be stressful for your eyes. So here is the light that can fill that ambience for you and make it a better, more comfortable user experience. Coming up is the review of the screen bar light by BenQ. Welcome to 4 Tech. As always, we bring you tech reviews, tips and tutorials to help you live life smarter. Now, all touch panels on the top with the light sensor, a favorite button that can be tapped to save your favorite light setting along with temperatures and brightness levels. The light on it is actually quite bright and you normally would not go for more than 50% I suppose. I guess it's around 450 lux bright already. Now the temperature on the screen bar is adjustable from 3000 Kelvin warm to 6500 Kelvin cool, depending on your light. Now I like it warmer when watching movies than I'm at a distance and prefer to keep it cold when I'm sitting close. It's got an easy clip and simple plug and play, fair bit of thought in design, so once you have it clipped on the screen, there is this small gap which is left for your camera. So if you're playing games or watching movies for long hours, you shall be fine with having enough light to make it easier for your eyes. It will get considerably hot after about an hour or so if brightness is all maxed out and it will drain a bit of battery from your laptop as well as it does draw 5 volts power directly from your laptop. You can turn on the ambient sensor which is like your phone, it basically figures out the light available in your surrounding and adjusts brightness accordingly. So the whole purpose of this tech is to create light without happening to reflect onto your screen and the whole point is to have that light fill the area ahead of the screen towards the keyboard and your palm rest. And does it quite well by getting rid of the glare we normally get from the usual lights on our desks. So if you don't have a backlit keyboard, then this light can come in handy as well. There are improvements I do believe should be there. The touch sensitive buttons on top of it should be uh, backlit at all times because they are quite hard to find if you're in dark. So you need to tap and once you tap on it, then they turn on. Considering it is made for low light, these buttons should naturally be backlit. Apart from those considerations, I think it's a very practical device. It comes from around $99. So for the value and benefit that it offers in the long run for your eyes, I think it's a great recommendation for people who work in low light situations, and especially for longer hours. So it will definitely help in reducing eye strain and headache caused due to concentrating on the screen directly. So that's it for the BenQ Screen Bar Light Review. Subscribe and like the channel if you guys enjoyed the video, and do let me know about your feedback in the comments section. I'll be seeing you soon with another review. Till again, Forest Deck signing out.